this film, uh, so I had like, I don't know, I believe there's no press on, but we got this print from the Hubley family because um, most of these war films don't exist anymore. I know you can find some on DVD and online and archive.org, I know you can find some, but most of them were destroyed after the war. They just didn't need them anymore. It's like anything, it's like it was an old piece of junk. Plus, it, it, in most cases, maybe not this one, but in most cases it was, it was dated. It was about something that just didn't apply to what was going on you know, 10 years from now. So they just didn't need this stuff and got rid of most of it. Luckily for us, in this case, the filmmaker kept up to save the copy, or sometimes a, a, a wartime projectionist saved some of the films. That's how some of these things still exist. This one tackles the problem of flying in your aircraft too low and bothering the people down below. That this was a pro apparently a problem for the Navy. Um, so they had to make a film about it. Anyway, but what's great is, is that uh, it was in public and it was a really great, uh, uh, it, 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 it was a great opportunity, that's the word, to try out some of these new ideas. And they did this a lot with these, these, these uh, army films that they made, to try out these ideas where the characters, again, don't look like the traditional. So let's take a look at this. It's only about four minutes long, I think, maybe five, five minutes. And it's about, it's a little educational. It's about, uh, so if you're a flyer, you'll learn something. 